Are you looking for the best 3D printers under $1,000? In this video, we will look at some of the best 3D printers under $1,000 on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Dremel DG Lab 3D45 3D Printer. Why it made the cut, go from unboxing to your first print in under 15 minutes using the printer's large full-color touchscreen with intuitive icons for easy setup and operation. For perfect 3D printed models every time, there's a reason the Dremel DG Lab 3D45 3D Printer regularly tops editors' pick lists as best 3D printer overall. The 5-inch, full-color touchscreen makes for simple setup and operation within 15 minutes, even right out of the box. And not only does the fully enclosed sturdy plastic design and large build volume provide better prints and optimal safety, but it also ensures a quiet operation. You could even have this 3D printer running while teaching a lab class because it runs so silently and smoothly. Other features include Wi-Fi connectivity with a built-in HD camera and included remote printing software so that you can print and monitor the progress from anywhere. In addition, the removable glass heated build plate heats up to 212 degrees Fahrenheit so you can print with a variety of plastic materials, including PLA, PTG, EZOABIS, and nylon, as well as ensuring easy removal and cleaning. This device also features an automated 9-point leveling sensor that detects any variation in the print bed and automatically accounts for it. One of the few gripes some users have is that the printer was designed primarily to use proprietary Dremel filaments, which come in a limited selection of colors and tend to be pricier than aftermarket filaments. To use off-brand filaments, you may have to buy a spool stand or make adapters to pipe through larger rolls. A handful of users also noted a firmware bug which renders the pause button kind of useless, as you can't simply pause and resume without the machine coming to a complete stop. At Number 2. Creality Ender 3v2 3D Printer. For those looking to dip their toe into the world of 3D printing, Creality's Ender 3v2 3D Printer makes the best 3D printer for beginners. Creality recently updated its popular Ender 3 with an updated user interface that makes this printer easier to use, a toolbox to hold all of its accessories, and a custom-built motherboard that ensures its motor doesn't make too much noise when printing. The Ender 3 V2 is compatible with the most common filaments, but won't work with more delicate ones, like glass. It also lacks an auto-leveling function, which means your prints may come out a little lopsided if you don't make sure its glass platform is perfectly flat. Still, this isn't a deal-breaker given the Ender 3 V2's entry-level price point, and it's easy to avoid problems if you take a couple of extra minutes to inspect the printer before making a print. We consider this printer's resume function to be its best feature, because it gives you some flexibility if something happens in the middle of your print. If you feel uncomfortable leaving the printer running while you're asleep or out of the house, the Ender V2 can accommodate your needs. We can confidently recommend Creality's Ender 3v2 to anyone who's been curious about 3D printing, but hasn't taken the leap because of price. Here are more of the best 3D printers for beginners. At Number 3. AnchorMake M5 3D Printer. The AnchorMake M5 3D Printer is a smart choice if speed is your priority. It prints at 250 mm per second, five times faster than some other 3D printers. The M5 is a FDM printer that works both horizontally and vertically and operates on Linux. The integrated die-cast aluminum alloy structure provides a stable base and auto-leveling. The M5 is also designed with an AI camera that helps identify errors such as extruder jams and failure of the model to stick to the print bed. The system sends notifications through the AnchorMake app, a helpful feature for beginners and experienced makers alike. The M5's build volume of 235 by 235 by 250 mm isn't as large as some, but it works with a range of materials, including PLA, PTG, ABS, and TPU. In addition to operating the machine through the app, you can also use the AnchorMake Slicer and Amazon's Alexa. At Number 4. Elego Mars 2 Pro Mono MSLA 3D Printer. This 3D printer's compact yet surprisingly spacious build volume is ideal for printing anything from board game miniatures and jewelry to small industrial parts. 
Significantly enhance your 3D printing efficiency with the best 3D printer for miniatures, the Elegumars 2 Pro Mono MSLA 3D printer, which takes just 2 seconds per layer exposure to cure resin so you can watch your miniature creations come to life even faster. With a lifespan up to 4 times longer than comparable printers, you can also expect an overall more stable performance and less maintenance. In other words, leveling will be the least of your problems with this model. Constructed of CNC machined aluminum from the build platform to the resin vat, this printer boasts high durability and solid quality that reliably gets the job done. Likewise, the Cobb UV LED light source provides optimal heat dissipation with a high luminous maintenance rate and uniform light emission to ensure an even print every time. As a few customer reviews have noted, however, you have to be really careful with the resin vat to avoid spills or leaks, leading to resin getting into your machine and corroding the parts. In addition, though the monochrome LCD screen is a nice touch, some users felt that it would have been better with a protective glass covering in the event of resin splashes. If you don't want to spend a lot, here are the best budget 3D printers. At Number 5. Anycubic Photon Mono X 3D Printer. This high-volume 3D printer can crank out flawless resin models at three times the speed, with impressive 3840 by 2400 pixel resolution. If you've tried filament 3D printers and get frustrated with clogged nozzles and stuck filaments, then Anycubic Photon Mono X 3D Printer, the best resin 3D printer, might be just the trick. With printing that's three times faster than traditional 3D printers, a single layer only takes one to two seconds for exposure even when you factor in the large capacity print volume for an impressively high resolution of 3840 by 2400 pixels. Other valuable features include a power adjustment function, which can adjust between 30% and 100% exposure, making it compatible with special resins such as dentistry and high temperature. Likewise, the brushed aluminum platform significantly enhances the adhesion between the platform and printers. Finally, the high-precision, high-transmittance UV light uses quartz lamp beads to ensure a more uniform light source. However, while avoiding the issues with filament 3D printing, resin can be a challenging material to work with. Everything must be thoroughly cleaned with alcohol, and changing the resin bath can be very expensive, as the brand uses only its proprietary sheets. Another minor gripe among some users is that the touchscreen is outdated and not tremendously responsive, using bubble-style buttons instead of a digital display. Here are more options for the best resin 3D printers. At Number 6. Wido Mini 3D Printer for Kids and Beginners You might have some pretty great ideas to try out and can't wait to get your hands on a 3D printer, but if you have little ones who want to take a crack at it or just aren't ready to invest in a bigger, more expensive piece until you understand the basics, the Wido Mini 3D Printer may be your best choice. The printer's compact design, under 11 inches tall, makes it an easily portable tool that's ready right out of the box, just plug it in and print. The mini printer's proximity sensor allows for auto bed aligning, which is a win for those who are new to 3D printing as you won't have to adjust the printing bed and can simply sit back while the printer does its magic. This is another intuitive printer that incorporates a resume printing function, so if there are any disruptions, you can pick up right where you left off. Finally, the low voltage, unheated print bed makes this a safer, preferred choice for kids or clumsy adults. At number 7. Robo E3. If you're serious about getting into 3D printing at home, but don't want to make the giant investment required for our top pick, Robo Z3 is the one to get. It's roughly the same size and weight as our other 3D printer recommendations, but it can work with a lot more materials than most. This gives you the freedom to create 3D prints that wouldn't be possible otherwise, especially if you're making objects that require different elements, like glass and metal. If you plan on printing the same objects over and over again, the E3's built-in storage will come in handy. That's doubly true if you accidentally delete a model on your computer. While these features add to the E3's cost, it's designed with an auto-calibrating print bed, which improves the odds of you ending up with a satisfying print rather than one that's lopsided. By reducing the number of prints you have to discard due to quality issues, the Robo E3 is great 3D printer for new and experienced users. Plus, it's a lot less wasteful because you won't throw away subpar prints on your way to perfection. The Robo E3 is so capable relative to most 3D printers it should be the only one you'll ever need unless you start using one for commercial purposes.